So it looks like the winner's round two. I don't know if that counts as top 60, top 32. Mm. I don't think it would be at this point. I think it is because oh, that's, it is? Six, that's 16 people in top... That's 16 people in winner's round two. Ah, here we go. So we're going through... I believe we're going through losers to establish what will be our top 32. It's coming thick and fast. We've had some great games. A lot of excitement. Plenty of hype in the audience. Yeah, this is uh, this is definitely the time where uh, where the audience kind of comes alive because there's no longer really other sets being played other than the big ones on the stream. Some We've people are getting knocked out. They they're hoping for their their hometown homies to get through. Absolutely. Speaking of hometown homies, we got our boy Con from South Australia, Fox. Well, let's call it Spacey's main Fox, uh, Falco and Wolf. Uh, Here we but go. Primarily Fox and Wolf. Um, absolutely. I, I feel like Con, and I've said this before on stream, is a uh, he's got a natural aptitude for the game, a parry and tech monster. <laughs> um, and, and perhaps he can sometimes just be his own worst enemy. All right, he's going for mod there. So yeah, on the other side, we have Master of Disaster, who took out Iroh uh, to progress, loses round two. Fantastic, and what a name as well. Yep. What a tag, Master of Disaster. So obviously just abbreviating that to mod. Now, uh, just deleting MM, don't know who that is, get rid of him. Yep. The winner of this earns the right to against South Australia's Blue. Um, so he took out Whistle, the other South Australian We Fit Trainer main. Yeah, so there we go. Some other matches I can report is that we've got uh, John Bombo, uh, aka OHKO. He has taken out Sifo. Um, Ari has taken out Jacko. Juan has taken out Vine Green. This is all in losers, by the way. Lumi has taken out Spuus. Ignis has taken out Q. And I'm 23 Bro, who we saw on stream at the beginning is still in the mix. He has uh, beaten Ever to fight him against Shadra in the next Ooh, round. Interesting, okay. So, what, a, what an interesting sort of match there. I believe I'm 23 was going to be going as, uh, as a Rob against a, uh, a Ken as well. Yep. So these, very, very are, these are all spots for top 32. Um, all these matches you're seeing, I think, are pretty much establishing. And just look at the crowd. It's There's standing and sitting room only. Absolutely, People are getting yeah. around it at the moment, and the excitement's palpable. Striking happening at the moment. Yeah, let's see what they uh, let's see what they bring out right here. Shadow Moses spam taunt. <laughs> yeah, I just want to hear. Uh, I just want to hear Otacon start talking again. Where's uh, where's my big boss? Alrighty, both players being incredibly patient here as well. I think as we get to sort of this part of the uh, of the tournament, it's uh, just as important that we kind of get the uh, the striking right. We get those bands right. Because uh, it can really, it can really spell disaster if you if you lose your first game based on a uh, based on a stage uh, stage error. Yes, Kalos the pick. Um, now I'm not too sure if Master of Disaster what he picks um, mod. I like the the abbreviation or the acronym now. Yeah, there we go. So yeah, Rob versus Fox. Alrighty. Oh my goodness, All we right. got a lot of Master excitement here. Master of Disaster has the crowd behind him. Let's get it done. Alrighty, this is uh this is it. This is gonna be. Still part of the top, uh, you know, we've got the top 64 here going on. We've got the, uh, oh, goodness gracious, already we're getting that reflect straight back out. Fox just being incredibly patient, throwing anything that uh, Rob has straight back at him. Now, here's the most difficult part as well, is what can, uh, what can Fox do once he finds himself in there, and what can Rob do to try and get himself out of these combos that Fox is going to have? And uh, Shield seems like the answer right now. Yeah, now. Jaro just waiting for him, and forward smashed into it. Yeah, there we go. You can't really get up. Oh, okay, the Jaro just waiting there. Such a great option. Oh. Whoa, I'm Rolling surprised away. he didn't get the second gyro hit on there. Amaze, yeah, the okay. Rollback. Very risky, but back air. Wow. Straight out of there. Mod. Master of Disaster taking stock one. Alright. Now Con waiting out as though uh, as though Master of Disaster has some form of Arsene or something. You can't wait him out, buddy. He's just gonna set up and he's gonna wait you. He's gonna wait for you, he's gonna meet you as soon as you get off that angel platform. Yep, and the Yeah, the shield getting so low there for Con. I feel like for a rushdown character like Fox, he's approaching it the right at the beginning of the stage, but now he just needs to show that he can get into the face of Rob. Yeah. There's the first parry, second parry. Oh, another parry. Oh my god. 
All right, you cannot parry that stuff in the air. All right, that's a very, very slow moving gyro to kind of get that uh, get that shine straight back into Rob's face. Up right, tilt, up tilt. Oh, getting the dragon. Ooh, down. nearly oh, the yeah. reset. Great tech though coming out from Master of Disaster. Oh, okay, again waiting for that shine, running straight up, going for uh, going for the down throw. We get the up air. Right. There he goes. Con getting that up air. That's a double hit as well. You can't be uh, can't be messing with that one, no sir. So Con getting underneath, but just punished by the neutral air. Oh, nice. Dropping down straight into the forward air. Great bit of damage there. All right, the, the con parries. You hear every time he parries, the crowd will just go absolutely nuts. They love and, it. And rightly so. He got almost 50% out of that combo. He's, he's next, to, next to even. Oh, sniping him straight out of the sky. That's the uh, that's the laser eyes right there. Oh, okay. Beautiful stuff from Con dragging himself against the stage to yeah, try and avoid getting just spiked. just stalling it out a little bit. That's, uh, that, that's what separates a good from a great Fox player. Oh my god! <laughs> he always just got snuck by, by his jar of moving at absolute turtle speed. Oh, Con going in for the grab. Now, I'm intrigued by these kind of baits here. I guess Master of Disaster is thinking, look, if I angle it downwards, if he jumps, he's going to get hit. If he doesn't jump, he's going to shine. And uh, and maybe he might just start, might just miss it altogether. So I'm interested to see. Maybe Con might start jumping and using the shine to try and reflect it back into Master of Disaster's face. Yeah, those recoveries, always tense moments there for Con. All right, nice. For the first time in history, a fox goes for a grab to throw him off the stage. Uh, you never see that happen. Oh, my God. Oh, okay. Right. Hey. Oh, oh, there we go. As if by prophecy. Bag. Yeah, he, he does exactly what I told him. Oh, he's very, very low, but wow. he does somehow make it back. 175% sniped at the edge. Oh, okay, he's oh. still got his jump. Yeah. Oh, wow. wow. Beefy up, he's straight across the ledge, actually uh, knocks away Master of Disaster. Back air, Ooh. takes it off the stage. Con at 191%. This game one is absolutely off the chain. Oh my up air. We're back to zero. Straight back to equal as well. No Fox has ever lived to 191%, and unfortunately, Con had to prove us right there. All right. Oh, okay. Tries to get out of it. Uh, going for the jab straight away again. Getting a third jab. Only 30%, but I mean, it's still something. Look at these mashes, though. Oh, okay. Getting hit. Up Second tilt, up, up tilt. tilt. Th third up tilt. Tries to reset with a tomahawk on the ground, but doesn't get yes. it. Oh, nice, getting a little getting a little shot in there. I mean, the only thing that Rob can really do there is use his gyro, or use his, uh, use his rotor to kind of send it back. But I mean, why would you do that? It's only going to give him 2%. Back on the platform with the neutral air, but the back air of Khan just takes him back off again. Nice. Again, grabbing with the get up on stage. Honestly, I'm getting quite a few of those. Back air oh takes it. Oh my goodness, straight into the face. There we go. The big fist pump back to his crowd. He's got the crowd on his side, and he's absolutely loving it. Con takes game number one. Big cheese, too. Let's get excited. This is really for top 32, you know? Get they around it. their tournament lives. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, this is going to be for, for quite a lot of the marbles, to be honest. This is uh, for, for people. If they want to stay on, they're going to have to beat, uh, they're to have to beat their, their opponent on stream. And m right now, Master of Disaster is, uh, is not looking too hot. But he's got, he's got a couple of games to, uh, to play with right now. If yeah. he wins, he might be able to get it back. And I'm kind of wondering where he wants to go on the one hand, you know, stages like maybe... Ten I mean, he, the side kills, maybe, he might be thinking. But, I mean, you don't want to give Fox too much room to just have free running around and deal with the projectiles too. It's, it's a tough balance. Yeah, something that was interesting as well. There was uh, not a single kill with an up smash there as well. Yep. Obviously, Lucalos being such an incredibly high ceiling, he was really focusing on those back airs, but he got them all. Uh, Underground advantage here for Lilac with Fox, but to the same effect, I think this is actually quite a good pick for for Rob. Again, those, that platform punish is really strong. Definitely, yeah, you can you can do a lot with them, and especially a lot of those uh, up throw combos, uh, up throw conversions as well. You've got so many options to get those kills slightly earlier with the the raised platforms. Whoa! Oh, wow! Forward just... smashing straight through it, and he's got gyro in hand. Throws it down. Those down tilts doing absolute work. And a laser punish. The parry. Okay, the, the jab locks. Oh, chasing another. right up the top. Oh, wow. Just, just kicking the gyro doesn't quite get Master of Disaster in his reach there. But uh, with such a low ceiling. Oh, okay. Looking for the, uh, looking for the uh, down smash instead. Now, with such low ceilings as Lilat, we're going to see maybe a couple more kills with up smashes. And we already saw him... We already saw Khan trying to go for it. Wow, that was 
Oh, nice. Almost hit him with that one. Oh, hang on. Oh. Someone's uh, someone's still got a pro controller connected. Uh, that's uh, hopefully Con does not have low battery. That would be an absolute travesty. That would be indeed. It should be right there. Oh, okay, great catching him with the uh, with the Fox Illusion. Goodness gracious, he's just gone straight for him. Catch him with the up air. Now 150. This is going to be a rub with a bit of rage. We might be able to see a couple of combos that uh, that Rob's got under his sleeve. If he's uh, if he's got those classic kind of set pro ones, just dropping the gyros into the Fortes. Uh, you, you can do some pretty crazy stuff with it. Uh, oh wow! Not falling, for the, not falling for the not falling for the up there. Not again! Oh my goodness! But that laser coming through, 50%. Rolling away from that. Oh okay. Interesting. I believe that slope kind of uh, kind of stopped that gyro from going anywhere. But the back air is not going to do anything uh, any favors either for mod. All right, down throw. And follows it up. I think they clash with that one. I'm gonna go for a, uh, a drill down there. And you can see Master of Disasters wising up to the grab and wow, the push take, forward down tilts. He's taking him across the whole entire stage as well. All right. Oh, too quick of a mash out for the up air. Oh, okay. Trying to go in with that neutral air landing. Oh, beautiful oh. stuff. Holding his shield up there, dropping straight into the gyro, getting that down smash. Great, great conversion there from Master of Disaster. Yeah, very, very smart. Great awareness. Master of Disaster going for a flight. I mean, he's in space, so it kind of only, it's only fair. Ooh, falling into the laser with the new player. And it becomes a more difficult proposition over time. Now, I'm interested to see, maybe those all these down tilts, because of the fact that Fox is such a fast faller as well, he can probably kind of get away with it. Yes. He just keeps dropping straight back onto the stage. Wow, Ooh, okay. okay, that was very clever though with the back air. You can space it appropriately. Oh, there we go. He threw that gyro up about 25 years ago and it came straight back down and punished Fox. You can see Fox wants to get that up tilt just to get something happening. Nice getting the up throw. Oh, with the gyro. Missing the uh, missing that side B there. Oh, wow. So not the uh, side B, the neutral B rather. High percentage for Con here. He's really a danger percent. Oh, there we go. Speaking of dangerous. Fox, when it, when it comes to those uh, those smash attacks, they're going to be killing pretty early. On top of that, we got a bit of rage. Oh boy, oh boy. Down tilt. Nothing coming out of it. Great parry, but the forward air actually still passes through it. Yep. Oh, geez, Luis, he's used his jump. Very difficult. There we go. All right, we've got a real game three situation on our hands here. So the victor goes to top 32. They do indeed. And the winner, that's it. You know, uh, to the loser, that's it. Well, so, Con with his pick of stage. It really seemed like Lilat uh, helped out Rob a whole lot. So intrigued to see uh, what the swap's going to be for uh, for Con here. He banter between one of his mates behind him. As he floats around. Perhaps a battlefield, I'm not sure. I can't imagine anything with too skinny a platform is actually really going to do, do him any favours, especially when it comes to Rob just poking through the stage there. He could do something with a higher platform, like a Unova, I'm not too sure. Yeah. He's really taking his time with this pick. He, he knows it knows it counts. Smashville it is, possibly. It can be dangerous uh, with some of the Rob side B stuff, but yeah, man, I think as soon as we said it, he's probably realised that himself. Mm. So we're going to Yoshi's, maybe. No, okay. Oh, it's a very, very, it's it's a very a indec uh, indecision. <laughs> You know, at one point we might actually just kind of just quit out and just go to Smash 4. I feel like that's how indecisive <laughs> we're looking right now. But no, we're sticking with it. Uh, now, after all that as well, I looked away for a split second. And we're going to have Fox and Rob sticking with the, uh, the, the red skin here as well. All oh, right, Master of Disaster wants the crowd behind him. They're getting rowdy. They're getting loud. Here we go. So Town and City, I believe, is going to be coming out. Or is this going to be Smashville here? All right, Jab's starting the damage. Ooh, the get-up attack. Beating out the neutral air. Oh boy, oh boy. It's incredibly, incredibly patient gameplay right now. We're kind of just waiting around, seeing uh, seeing what opening either one of these players can find. 
right catch on that neutral air into the up air. Beautiful stuff. Yeah, it's the fastest option Con really could have done, and uh, Master of Disaster is completely ready for it. Grab with the get up attack. Really doing quite well for him. There's the parry, the Con parry. Full in neutral uh, air. Wow, the jab not holding it quite long enough. Getting punished hard for it. Nice, yep. the side B into the up air as well. Oh, okay, getting back a bicycle forward, kick. So yeah. Back air. Damn. There we go. What a what a reversal of fortune. Although it did look like for a, for a little hot second, uh, Fox is in a bit of a state of disadvantage. He's completely uh, corrected us. All right, nice. There we go. Beautiful stuff. Good choice. Yeah. Oh, there we go. The spike. Such an incredibly uh, <laughs> an incredibly exploitable recovery. Yeah. Very uh, linear Fox. and just there's nowhere else for him to go up against like a wall. So yeah. Getting a couple of those down tilts, that's something you just got to respect out of Rob. Once you get caught, it's kind of hard to uh, hard to get away. Okay, getting the up tilt, neutral air, and then parry. Oh my goodness. Up tilt again. He's laying it all onto Master of Disaster now. He's getting that back air as well. The damage is absolutely up there. The damage, 120.4%. Oh wow, just copping that gyro straight to the forehead. Oh, right, getting that. Wow, into the forward smash. Not enough just yet. Oh, wow, looking for the down air as well. Not going to connect, though. Uh, Fox Illusion is much, much faster than the up. Ooh. Wow, okay. Gyro into up smash. That's a confirm. Stops me in my tracks there. 144% though. Oh, we're just going yeah, for the raw you, up smash. You can see Connors really wants that kill. He'll do anything to get it, but he doesn't want to put himself at risk in doing so. Nice, there we go. Connie. All right, game three, last dog. Oh my goodness. The down tilts are coming out. All right, trying to land, trying to get a, a bit of extra shield pressure there as well. And for the up air as well. Air dodging in, he's not going to be, uh, not going to fall off the stage just yet. Oh, oh, great, great call out there. Yeah, that shine just took it from a, a losing percentage to a lead. Nice, back getting air, another back more. air. In the next couple of hits are going to do it. Ooh. Spot dodge. Oh, he misses the tech. Oh, tries All to right. read the uh, roll in. Parry into the up into smash. It. And time he's is done up it. and up. The madman, he's insane. Signature style. Parry into up smash. I didn't, I didn't try and build everyone up on that for nothing. This is what he does. This is what he's good for. Look at that. But see, th this is precisely why I love the Australian scene. Both players so incredibly respectful of each other as well. As soon as they finished up, they instantly went in straight for the hug, straight yep. for the fist bump as well. But I mean, look at the support that both players have gotten. They've gone just behind them as well. This is a, this is you know, a, a, an event of you know 200 odd players, and uh, they're all here to support uh, these two characters on the screen right now as Fox continues on.